Assalamu alaikum. Now, let's say we do not have SPSS or uh, we do not want to buy SPSS or we do not want to use the pirated version of uh, SPSS. Is there any alternative that one can use? Well, yes, there is a very viable alternative and we call it Tomovi. And we've got two versions here, 1.1.9 solid and 1.2.22 current. Uh, it's very easy to download. Just go to Google, write Tomovi download. And what you'll get is clicking this link here, you will get this page. So just download this current version. And once, once it's downloaded, just double click and a few clicks will give you the installed uh, software. Now let's open Jamovi. So in order to open it, what you can do is you can write or you can go to start. And here it is, Jamovi 1.2.22. Click on it. And it is starting. Now here it is. Let's maximize it. So if we see, uh, you can add obviously more modules to it if you want. There are a number of different modules available. It's an open source software, so this it will keep evolving. So let's see what modules we have. Just click this plus button and go to, these are the installed modules. You can obviously download the source file and obviously download it, uh, the, uh, install it that way as well. And uh, these are the installed files that you can obviously hide or remove as well. And if you want to add more modules, just go to the movie library. And here are a number of different modules that are available. You can do power analysis using JPower. You can have an R editor to run R code. And you can have number of different modules that you can use. I've already in, got this mediation model. Now, a number of modules are already installed and you can look into it, whatever fits your requirements, just download them and or easily install them from this dialog box here. Now, it already shows three columns or three variables. We do not need this, so just delete them. And let's see how to import data. Just click these three lines here, click import and browse. So you can obviously download or obviously import CSV file. You can uh, do open document, Excel, SPSS, R data, Stata, SAS, JASP, a number of different formats. In this case, let's import an SPSS file. Just click on it, open. And here it is. All your data imported as you see in an SPSS file or an Excel sheet. Now let's say we are interested in exploration of the data. Uh, you can do other stuff as well. You can do t-tests, you can do ANOVA, one-way ANOVA, ANCOVA, MENCOVA, repeated measures ANOVA. You can do regression as well. You can do frequencies as well. Factor analysis, principal component analysis, exploratory factor analysis, confirmatory factor analysis, simple mediation, simple moderation, complex mediation with multiple mediators as well. And this is something uh, I haven't checked. So let's do exploration. Let's do, let's say we want descriptives. So the good thing is it produces formatted output. Let's say I want to know the descriptives for country. So we select country, put it in variables. You can obviously split it by gender or uh, any other variable. Let's say we want frequency tables. So these are categorical variables. And this is continuous variable. In this case, country is a categorical variable. And we've got the frequencies here. We can have other, we can have other st statistics as well. Let's say you've got, you do not need mean because it's a categorical variable. We can have median. We do not need median. We need mode. Or you can have, say, 
let's say you can have plots so these are for continuous variable so we can have bar plot and here it is so this is how you can use Jamovi uh, install it and use it for basic descriptives or basic frequencies similarly you can do other variables as well but the objective of this particular session was just to introduce Jamovi to you what you can do is just right click on it select all and you can obviously export it or copy it in any format you want in this case obviously it's PDF or HTML and once you copy it what you can do is right click select all copy and just open word document and you can paste it here see and this is the reference obviously uh, it's always good to acknowledge the software because it's giving you so much ease in doing your analysis so this is the descriptive you can obviously format it if you want so this is how you can use Jamovi uh, obviously we'll be doing a lot of uh, a lot more videos on how to use Jamovi the different kind of analysis uh, it does and doing so we'll, we'll be learning the software as well and the analysis as well I hope you will enjoy using Jamovi thank you